Hi, this is Bela Notsky, CTO of Access Systems. In XBand 649, we have a lot of new features, and there's one of them I'd like to show you right now, which is the override of the coding. So let's say I have a particular object, like this church, and let's say I want to change the font of only this one object and not the other ones, like this here below. So in order to do so, I open up my base functions and I choose here the define button and then I go on and I choose a different font. Let's pick um, that one for instance. So as you can see, the symbolization of this object changed but not of this one of the same object display group here below. This one still gets its font from the coding. If I don't like it, of course I always have the opportunity to revert this. I change it back to my default font which comes from the coding. Or I can do it again. Now let's say I want to save this into the coding. To do so, I choose to define again, and I choose here, copy to coding. Here I get a list of map images that are affected by this particular coding. If this is okay for me, I press the save, and now the changes are written back into the coding, and the new font is shared by all objects that have the same object display group. Please check the release notes of XPEN 649 to find out more. Thank you for your attention.